So for our first module, we're going to look at the different components of the balance sheet. We're going to look at the effect of different types of transactions on the balance sheet. And we're going to look at different forms of corporate organizations, so proprietorships, partnerships, corporations, and how each of them has advantages and disadvantages. Uh, we're also going to look at the function of an audit. So you know, a lot of you, there were different roles in accounting. Some of you don't exactly work in accounting. Um, but accounting plays an important role. You know, it not only is Doing the books of the company every period is also internal auditing. Accounting is also used for measuring efficiency and profitability internally. There's a whole other branch of accounting called uh, managerial accounting or cost accounting, and that focuses on internal measures. We're going to be focusing on external measures. So we're really going to be taking the perspective of an investor or maybe a lender or somebody who is you know, has an investment or is considering an investment in a company. We're also going to be looking at the perspective of a regulator and looking at whether a company's accounting is fair or you know, it's distorted in any way, which is the same thing you would do as an investor. A lot of times when you look at a company, your goal is to obviously understand the accounting if there are any misrepresentations or distortions in that accounting so that you can arrive at a more uh, fair valuation. Uh, we're also going to look at the regulation of financial accounting. Uh, not super interesting, but also very important. Many of you are regulators, and uh, the regulation of financial reporting is designed primarily to ensure that investors and lenders and the government is giving a fair uh, representation of the information from a company or from an entity that's uh, providing financial statements. 